Welcome to the Arsinogen Archives. I am Arsinogen, and as part of our recruitment efforts, we created this video to answer some questions you might have had to tell you what we're all about and to talk about what a team member actually does. So, to start out with, my name is Carson, I'm 23 years old, and this is my website, and I've been running it for about nine months. Hello, I am Colin, or Third Wise Man. I am 17 years old and have been working for Arsogen Archives for five months as a writer. I brought Colin in as a writer about five months ago. He wanted more exposure and I wanted more content, so it's a mutually beneficial relationship that we have. The Arsenogen Archive is a collection of information on video games of all types, all platforms. The cool thing about being an information center is that you never run out of material. There's an infinite amount of video games out there and so many great ones that don't get the attention they deserve. I'm sure there's plenty of people out there, plenty of people watching this video that suffer from blind browsing as much as I do. I skip through entire pages of games on my Xbox just because I have never heard of them before. Gaming is an expensive hobby. I'm sure that many of the people watching this video are well aware of that. We're, we're not going to try and hide it if we got every game we wanted. We'd be broke. Most of us, anyway. This website is here for you. It exists to provide information that can cure blind browsing and help you make educated choices. I write reviews of any type of games. I love putting my word out there and helping others decide if they should try a game. If you love gaming and have a YouTube or Twitch channel, writing reviews might be a good path. It gives you good materials to create videos on, entertain others, and gives you a different aspect and something to, interesting to write about. We're looking for people to write and make videos for the website. Like Colin said, Twitch streamers and YouTubers are excellent candidates for the job, but you don't need to be a gamer trying to grow their fan base to become a content creator for the archives. I believe that anybody that doesn't find a chore out of writing should definitely try writing reviews. There are games out there, like plenty of games out there, anybody can find something to write about. Uh, the process is pretty simple. When finished your first draft, then it will be sent off and come back with some comments. These notes are very simple to help you fix your issues and make your second draft or final draft perfect. You can take as much time as you need to make sure that your project is polished and ready to publish. Your writing is your writing, and just remember that personality is a very big thing that readers love. Don't worry that you're not good enough at writing or editing or that you don't have the right equipment or the right games. If you want to give it a try, we will figure something out because we want you to be part of the community. And just in case you're wavering on the fence, I'm going to give you some really good reasons why you should want to get your stuff onto this website. Number one, maybe a person or two will think you're handsome or beautiful or gorgeous and they'll just visit your Twitch page or your YouTube page or whatever social media page just because they think you are absolutely stunning, right? Number two, maybe you have certain expertise that someone else is looking for. And back to the thing where Colin said, helping you pick the right game, maybe your page on some obscure game that no one has ever heard of help someone decide whether or not to try it. Maybe they see the game on the website for the first time and they're like, hey, that kind of sounds interesting, or that sounds really messed up, or that sounds like the worst game that I've ever heard of. I'm gonna go play it. And finally, the money, yes. For the money, you don't get paid a lot, but you get paid per project, and there's uh, a way that we figure out how much you're gonna get paid. It's not a set amount, it kinda depends on what you do. But you always get paid something. It goes up on the site and you can show your friends and be like, hey, I'm on a website. I'm immortalized on the interwebs forever. Don't forget to visit the actual website if you're not there already. It's www.arsinogen-archives.com. Thank you guys for listening. Check out my YouTube or Twitch at Third Wise Man. I post a variety of videos. I try to stream daily. Also, check out my clan, Rain Nation. And remember, love what you are doing and chase your dreams, guys. Don't be afraid to get in contact with us on Twitter, on the website, send an email, a private message on Twitch. There are so many ways to get a hold of us, so don't be shy. Even if you're just thinking about it, if you think you might not, but you just kinda wanna know more, 
go ahead and send us a message anyway. We'd be happy to talk about it. If you enjoy writing, then this is something that you should apply for. Thank you guys for watching. And now I have to edit this video and splice it together, and I have a ton of work to do tonight. It's 9 o'clock, so I'm going to say goodbye. I hope you all have a good night, morning, afternoon, evening, overnight, whatever time it is, wherever you are, and I will see you next time. Go. I'm sure there's plenty of people out there. Like Colin said, Twitch streamers and YouTubers, <clears throat> voice crack. Go. Reasons why you would want to do this. I will. Are you done? You lose some fucking WD-40 on my door. My God. Finally. All right. Finally, they're gone. Minute 35. Let's go. Let's go. Like Colin said, Twitch streamers and YouTubers. Try again. Right and try again. God, one line. I had one line. Try again.